Hi everyone, the PPT Pro here. Today we are going to learn how to do this image animation on PowerPoint with just few easy steps. Let's roll. A special thank you for Kuba and Milan for their great comments. Thank you guys. So as always, first thing to do is to grab some high quality images from Insplash. After inserting the images downloaded from Insplash, crop them like that. Then try to make the corner round. Repeat the same process with the other images as shown. Now I will let you with this process of the crop and the corner around. After cropping all the pictures, now you need to reduce their size. So to do it perfectly, hold shift and move one of the corners like that. Now after the reducing of the size, now you need to distribute them in the same distance like that. After that, pick a group of pictures, five maybe or four, like that, and group them by holding Ctrl G. Now incline each group in the same way as I did. It's time to create that faded white effect. So you need to insert a rectangle like that, incline it a little bit, choose a suitable position like that. Then go to format shape, choose soft edges, and increase it by 45 points then choose the white color don't forget to remove the outlines then choose the perfect position for the rectangle Now it's time to add the titles and the text. As usual, go to insert text box and tap your title like that. Change the size and the font of course.
After adding the text, I add this arrow and animate it with the wipe animation. Now duplicate the slide by holding Ctrl D. Then go to the first slide and change the placement of the group of pictures, like that. Not only the picture, then the title and the arrow and the text. Now in group all the group of picture by holding Ctrl Shift and G. Now duplicate the second slide again then change the placement of the elements like that. By keeping on holding shift, select these pictures and move them out of frame like that. Now group these six pictures like that by holding Ctrl G of course and rotate them to be aligned with the frame. Now ingroup them by holding Ctrl Shift G. You need to make the first picture bigger than the others like that. Then bring closer the little pictures to it. Now duplicate the slide, remove the bigger picture and replace it with the first little one. Repeat the same process with the third picture. Now at the final phase, duplicate this slide, then remove all the elements. As the beginning of each presentation, I add the name of the company and the logo. I do the same thing with the ending too. Now we are going to apply the key to the animation. Select any slide, hit Ctrl A, then go to Transition, Morph, and reduce the timing to 0.75. So this is it people, thank you for watching, I hope I did a great job in the explanation. The link to download this presentation is in the description box, you can download it for free. So stay safe, stay creative.